Hey everyone, in today's episode, we're going to learn how to install and activate Chaos Vantage using the basic and advanced installation options. First things first, let's head to the official Chaos Vantage website. You can search for it on Google, or you can use the link down in the description. For this tutorial, we're going to use a trial account, which is perfect for exploring the software options. Go ahead and click the Start Your Trial button on the website. When you click it, you will land on a registration page where you will need to add a valid email, enter your first and last name, and create a strong password. Once everything is filled in, hit Create Account. Next, check your email for a confirmation link. After you click that link, you may see a few additional questions about your profession or company size. Fill those in, and you will then see two options on your screen, Manage your license and Discover plans and pricing. We're going to select Manage your license to keep moving forward. In the License Management section, you will see all your active license. Here, you can filter products, check activation and expiration dates, and view available cloud credits. There's a download button here as well. Let's click on that. Now, on the Downloads page, find Chaos Vantage and select the version compatible with your system. Once you have downloaded the correct version, double-click it to begin the installation process. The installer will show up with two options, Basic Install and Advanced. Before continue, just make sure you have checked the boxes to accept the end user license agreement and the global consumer privacy policy. Now, let's start with the basic installation. Just click the install button and the installation will kick off automatically. If you already have an older version of Chaos Vantage installed, this process will remove it for you. It will first uninstall the previous version before setting up the new one, all without any input. Once the installation is done, you will see an option to check or uncheck the anonymized telemetry bots. This simply lets you decide if you want to share anonymous uses data with Chaos. Once you have made your choice, go ahead and click Done. All right, now onto the advanced installation for those that want a little bit more of control. Click on Advanced. First, we can select the installation directory, but I recommend to keep it as is. We can also add the firewall exceptions, add a shortcut, and associate Vantage files. I recommend you to keep the default settings. Once this is done, click Continue. Now, we move to the licensing section. Here, you will select between a local or remote license. For a remote license, you will need to enter the IP address of your primary or alternative license server. If you want to use both remote license and local, enter the IP 127.0.0.1.3034 for the local server. If you're setting up a local license, you're all set. The license server is already included in the workstation installation. Just select it and press continue. Once everything is configured, click install. Just like before, Chaos Vantage will automatically uninstall any previous versions and install the new one. When it's all done, hit done to complete the setup. You will be taken to a browser page with confirmation of a successful installation and documentation links to help you get started. Now, let's activate your Chaos Vantage license. Start by opening Chaos Vantage. If prompt, Log in to your Chaos account. This will automatically activate available license on your computer. Another option is by opening 3ds Max. Then press F10 to bring up the setup menu. Make sure V-Ray or Corona is set as the default render by going to the render section. Once you have one of those selected, go over to the settings section. Here, you will find two options in the authorization section. Edit license server information. Use these if you need to update the IP address for your license server. For local setups, you will want to set up the IP 127.0.0.1 and the port to 3034, which are the default settings for local license server. Manage Chaos License Server. This is what we will use to activate the license. Click this button and a new browser page will open to the local Chaos License Server. Log into your account here and V-Ray will automatically activate any license available on your computer. Once you are on the license management page, you will see the details about your active license. Click the three lines in the top right to open a menu where you will find notifications, settings, help, and about. For more details on any product, click on its icon. This will show you specifics about your license, such as the type and how many licenses are available or in use. This feature is especially helpful for studios with multiple licenses as it gives a clear view of the license available and usage. And that's it. You're all set to start creating amazing visuals with Chaos Vantage. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to click the like and subscribe button. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. And thank you for watching.